Hello everybody, this is LOL Freddy again with another video. And today's video is going to be about Cyberpunk 2077. Cyberpunk 2077. Um, it's dodge uh, disabling feature. It's not a feature that's built into the game, but if you're on PC, I can go ahead and show you how to go ahead and disable that so you don't accidentally uh, dodge forward, left, right, or back when you're sneaking or going around corners and things like that. So as you can see, I don't have the dodge mechanic anymore. I disabled it. So I can tap as much as I want, left, right, forward, back, and my character won't dodge, which is pretty cool. So to do that, let me go ahead and show you. So this is the directory we need to navigate to, and I will show you how to get there. I just wanna show you what it looks like. So in order to get to this directory, to the specific uh, input context.xml file, We'll go ahead and uh, open up a new uh, file explorer window. Okay, so from here we can go to this PC. From this PC we go to local disk C. Then we go to program files 86. Then from there we're going to go ahead and navigate down to Steam. Then from Steam we do Steam apps. Then from Steam apps we go over to common. Then from common we find the game Cyberpunk 2077. Okay, and then from here, we go to the R6 folder. Once here, we're going to go ahead and go into the config folder. And once we're here, we're going to go ahead and uh, go ahead and open up the input context.xml file. So to do that, just right click on it. And then we're going to go ahead and open with notepad. Okay, once here, let's go ahead and press control F and type dodge forward all together with no spaces like this on the screen. Click find next. First one is not gonna be it, click it again. And that's not it, click it again. Here we go. So we wanna find the dodge forward line, multi-tap action equals dodge forward with a count number. By default, this count number is going to be two, which equals double pressing a key, in this case the W key, to dodge forward and it will initiate the dodge uh, function. So in order to disable that, so you don't accidentally keep dodging whenever you try to dodge or sneak around a, a stage or something, an area, just go ahead and change that count from two to 99, like shown here. So only do this for dodge forward, dodge right, dodge back, and dodge left. 99, 99, 99, 99. Don't touch the one up here where it says multi-tap action dodge count equals two. Leave that alone. Just leave it at two. Just change these four. And once you do that, um, if you have the game open, make sure that you close the game out. Actually, let me go back a little bit. So once you do that, obviously close this out. Make sure that's 99. And then make sure you save it. So save the, uh, the changes. Once the, sa the uh, changes are saved, um, if you have the game running, Cyberpunk 2077 running, just go ahead, save your progress, quit out of the game, and relaunch the game. And then once you relaunch the game, you're going to notice that you no longer have the uh, double tap dodge function in the game anymore. So if you're in an area where it's like really heavy with sneak, you can disable that by following my instructions. And if you want to get it back, just do the same thing we just did with the uh, instructions. And instead of 99, go back to those four lines and switch it back to two. Once you switch it back to two and you relaunch the game, you'll have your dodge function back in the game. Okay. And that's pretty much it. So if you guys are having problems with the game and accidentally dodging while sneaking and blowing your cover, uh, follow these instructions and you should be good to go. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. If you guys have any questions or any comments, just feel free to drop those below. And if you uh, liked this video and it helped you, go ahead and click like. Uh, anyways, have fun out there in Cyberpunk 2077 world, and uh, I'll see you guys around. Bye.